Check out these awesome abandoned movie sets. We don't think much of what happens to movie sets once they're done and used. Sometimes they get torn down, other times they get left to decay. Here are 10 movie sets that have been left behind and have an almost creepy yet awesome presence about them now. Iron Man. This is from the series of scenes where Tony Stark built the first iteration of his iconic suit to escape his captors. Schindler's List. With such an emotional and amazing movie, it's an odd feeling to see the set left to the ravages of time. Lord of the Rings, Hobbiton. Hobbiton, which is fictionally nestled in the Shire, is actually a field in New Zealand. The Hobbit holes were once stripped of any recognizable form and were home to sheep. Lots and lots of sheep. Now it's been renovated and is a tourist attraction. The Abyss. James Cameron's awesome film of a deep-sea mining crew that encounters an alien intelligence is an awesome experience and one you should watch if you haven't seen it. The sets were grand and most were actually filmed underwater. To accomplish this, many of the sets were built in large tanks. When production wrapped, many were left in the tanks and then drained. Looper. The infamous diner scene was shot in the middle of a field with a mock diner built for the production. When filming finished, the diner was left instead of being torn apart. Kind of cool. Big Fish. The town Will visits in the Tim Burton classic was a whimsical and beautifully crafted set piece. However, once shooting ended in the town of Spectre, the crew and cast packed their bags never to return. Almost seems sad in some way, really. Batman. This is a set from the original Tim Burton-directed Batman film starring Michael Keaton. Strangely, this part of Gotham doesn't look that much different than it did in the film, considering the set is 26 years old. Star Wars. Luke's home on Tatooine is looking a little rough. The scene was shot and built in Tunisia, Africa. District 12. If you've ever wanted to live in a dystopian future and live out your inner Katniss, well, now you can. Once filming finished for the first Hunger Games movie, the set was left to rot. It's a pretty popular spot for fans, so be careful you don't accidentally get shot. May the odds be ever in your favor. The Hills Have Eyes. Not sure why you'd ever want to visit this set. I mean, if you're really looking to get brutally murdered by cannibals, by all means. It looks cool, though. But yeah, nope. 